Being smart, what does this mean? Education in our society has had its simple stand on this, and it's a pretty simple concept. If we take the newest grading system, grade one is at the bottom, and grade nine, 100% is at the top. And I remember a time when I got 100% once in a test in year nine, and believe me, I was absolutely ecstatic. I mean, to me at the time, and I'm sure to a lot of you now, getting full marks on a test means that you are smart. Pretty much confirms it, right? So to celebrate, I went home to do one of my favorite hobbies, which is cooking. Now, yes, the TV was on in the background, and yes, my focus wasn't at its best after school. So while I was cooking, I suddenly smell burning. I look a little to my right, and there, next to the stove, is a piece of kitchen towel on fire. The flames getting bigger and bigger every second I stared at it. And I didn't know what to do. Do I call my mom? Do I call my dad? Do I call 999? I, I absolutely froze. So what I did, what every sane, smart, and intelligent individual would have done at the time, I take the nearest object next to me, which was at the time, a kitchen roll, and I start banging the fire in order to put it out. Not the smartest idea. People in our society put, put too much stress on grades as the main driving force for how smart a person can be in their life. I mean, I thought I was smart with that 100%, but if my first instinct of putting out a fire is, no, not to throw water over it, to hit it so that it goes away, was I really that smart? Now, granted, my dad did come in later to save the day by actually throwing water over the fire, but what if that had happened in the future? Could I have chucked a couple of ace stars at the flames to make them go away? Could I use the square root of pi to make friends, or a single ionic equation to guarantee me a job? And suddenly you realize that maybe being smart, especially in life, is a little less about the grades you get. Now, our study was done on IA students, and out of six causes, a whopping 61% of those students said that grades were their main cause of stress in life. Grades and test scores are good things, but grades and test scores are these things that we should strive for, things meant to bring us up to that nine. But instead, we're being brought down to a one. In the stress to be called what society labels as smart, we forget about socializing, we forget about making friends, we forget about health and safety. So the next time you look at a grade, somebody's grade, and make a judgment purely on that, remember this. Academics can be learned from books, academics can be studied, but when it comes to being smart, especially in life, well, there's no textbook for that.